and today I'll be unboxing the Wand Company's Replica Pokeball. This was released back in February of 2021. I was a huge fan of Pokemon back in the 90s and I haven't had a chance to really play a lot of the more recent games. So my heart's kind of been back in the original Gen 1 Pokemon. So this Pokeball is really special to me and I was really glad I was able to get one. Um, right now it MSRPs at around $100 and I live in the US so it's only available on online retailers like Amazon and GameStop. I happened to get this at GameStop for about $70. It was on discount so really happy at that price. Okay, so let's get started with the unboxing. A okay, nice little sealed pamphlet here. Let's put that off to the side. Ooh, okay, I like that. I like how they have the um, Pokeball right on the styrofoam. That's a really nice touch. Okay, the display case, put that over here. And then the Pokeball itself. Ooh, it's got some weight to it. That's pretty nice too. Okay, it's a little tab here I'm gonna pull, probably for the battery. This looks really good. It feels nice, the material is really solid. Like, there's nothing cheap feeling about this, which I'd expect. Not sure if it's charged though. Oh, nope, it is. Okay, I think you can customize the color of this LED but I'll go and figure that out in a bit. Oh yeah, there we go. That's cool. So I'll take a look at the manual in a bit. Let's take a look at the uh, display case. So the case doesn't feel as good as a Pokeball, it feels more like plastic. But it has a really cool rising action on that base right there. And then another tag here for the battery. So I think these take AA batteries. A little sad that I can't charge it, but... Take what we get, right? Cool, so the base here lights up a bit. And with the Pokeball on, it does look like it knows that the Pokeball is on and the base is glowing a different color. Still, first impression's pretty cool. Let me just open it in front of camera. How sick is that? Okay, so it takes three AA batteries. It looks like there is a secret compartment. Well, I guess it's gonna be a secret compartment, but on the underside, there are some screws you take out and then a metal display ring you can place it on. That's pretty neat too if you don't wanna use the uh, box. But you do need a screwdriver and I'm too lazy to go get one. And it does look like the Pokeball itself takes one battery Oh, no, 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 it takes three AAA batteries. Nice. Overall, I think it looks pretty cool. It is proximity sensing, so when it senses my hand coming towards it, it'll glow. Really cool. I think if you are a fan of Pokemon and you just want something to show off on your desk. I think this is a really cool purchase. Well, thanks for watching everyone and um, catch you on the next one.